the new girl. <laughs> the sound is coming from here. Huh? Why did it stop? <laughs> what was that? <sighs> Look at all the peaches! Huh? Help me shoot one down, please! Problem? Leave huh? it to me! Oh, oh gee, us! Shoot some more down! One isn't enough for us! Huh? 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 <laughs> Amazing! Whose shot was that? Oh, I'm sorry. Huh? huh? I didn't mean to intrude. I'm Mooney. Did you shoot that arrow? Hmm. My, my, and I heard you say that you needed some peaches. So we came over to help. Oh. <sighs> you shot down three peaches with one arrow. I can shoot down some more if you want. Incredible! Thanks for helping us harvest the peaches. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to the Flying Squirrel Village. Do you know how to get there? I know the way. I'll take you. <laughs> huh? <laughs> 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 Who is that girl? Mooney is your new classmate. She and... Mai Mai are from the Hills Ocean Village of the Paiwan people. Let's give them a warm welcome to Flying Squirrel Village. <laughs> Hello, everyone. I'm Mooney. I'm so happy to be here and learn with all of you. Nai <laughs> Nai! <laughs> so you're called Nai Nai? Nai Nai? Please don't do that again. Nai Nai? This is a Paiwan flower crown, and it represents the blessings of a new friendship. I wish you great happiness. All right, students. Tomorrow we will have music class, and you'll learn to play the tile wood xylophone. What's in a tile wood xylophone? Yeah, you'll find out in class tomorrow. <laughs> After class, I'm going to gather materials to make the xylophone. Does anyone want to come with me? Me! I want to go! Me too! <laughs> I want to go too! shoot so accurately. Is there a trick to it? An archery accuracy comes with practice. Your posture and balance have to be just right. Wait. Hmm? Wait, hang on. Why are we whispering? Huh? Huh? He says it's because girls aren't supposed to shoot. But why not? Mooney, Bayan says your mom is a murhu and that you'll be it someday too. Is that true? But who? It's the leader of the village. Oh, yeah, that is true. I'll be the leader of the village when I'm older. I've heard that Uncle Dola is the leader here, so that's what you want to be when you grow up, right? Hmm. She wants to be Murhu, but in a tile culture, only men can be hmm. Murhu. Hmm. Huh? Oh. <laughs> Mai Mai has bamboo tube rice on his back. A really long bamboo tube rice. Mai okay. Mai! I want some of your bamboo tube rice! Mai! Mama! Bayan, where are the 
the trees used for making the Atelier xylophone? They're right here. This is the kind of tree for making Atelier xylophones. <laughs> I know! It's a tongue oil tree! That's right. Tongue oil trees have very solid wood, which gives the wood harp a richer sound. So if we cut down the tree, we can make our wooden xylophones! Freshly cut wood cannot be used immediately. Because the sound quality of the instrument depends on the type of wood, length, moisture, and then the thickness. First, we have to place the wood in a cool, dry place and leave it to dry for a while. And once the wood is then dry, you can remove the bark and start to make the wooden xylophone. Oh, so we can't start to make the xylophone now. I thought we'd at least be able to play it today. I can make a xylophone too! My, my! I'm sure you never guessed I had my own bamboo tube rice! That's a xylophone? Mooney, that's not a xylophone. The real Atile xylophone is here. Go and give it a try. The four pieces of wood that make the xylophone can play the notes re, mi, so, and la. How do the pieces of wood make different sounds then? When I look at them like this, they all look the same to me. It is because of all the different lengths. There are air molecules all around us. Sound is created when a vibrating object causes vibration in the air around it. This then creates sound waves. When these sound waves finally reach our ears, we can hear the sound that they make. In the same amount of time, a shorter object will vibrate more times, so the vibration frequency is much, much higher, which creates a higher pitched sound. A longer object will vibrate fewer times, so the vibration frequency is much lower, which results in a lower pitched sound. Therefore, different lengths of wood produce different sound pitches. In addition to length, the density and the thickness of the material will also affect the sound pitch. Oh, so that's how it works. But, um, how do you play a song then? Let me think. Moody is so talented! She can shoot and play the xylophone! Hmm. Actually, I don't know how to play. I can play. Uh -huh. Let me have a go. play beautifully together. <laughs> that song I heard this morning was your flute? And you play it with your nose? Huh? So I guess it's not a really long bamboo tube rice, it's a flute. Actually, this is the Pi One nose flute. It's my favorite instrument. Bayan, I have a question for you. How does my flute make different sounds? If the instrument itself is the same length? <laughs> The flute may seem like it's the same on the outside, but things change on the inside. When we play the flute, the air inside the tube vibrates and produces sound. When your fingers cover the holes on the flute, the air column inside the flute changes and affects the pitch. The more holes that you cover, the longer the air columns become and the lower the pitch of the sound. The fewer holes that you cover, the shorter the air column becomes, so the sound produced is a higher pitch. Mooney, your nose flute sounds so beautiful. Why did you hide when you were playing before, huh? Because uh, I want girls aren't allowed to play the nose flute. But I just can't help myself because I really love sharing music with people. Huh? Paiwan girls can become leaders, but they can't play the nose flute? Mooney, mm -hmm. you play the nose flute and I play the xylophone. Let's make music together. Huh? <laughs> Mooney? You. I'm so happy to meet you. Oh, wow, it's beautiful. Thank you. 
apologize to huh? you. Huh? I was so jealous of you earlier because you'll get to be the Mahoro someday. So... Oh, it's okay. If we work together, we can help each other to realize our dreams. Yeah! Let's go home. <laughs> <laughs> I hope that someday I can travel to Mooney's home and visit the Hills Ocean Village where women can be leaders. Thank you. 